My name's Jack Truscott. I was born within the sound of Bow Bells in London. Um, just after the war, I moved north with my parents to Leeds. I left school at 15 and took an engineering apprenticeship. Um, this gave me a good practical background for what I do now. I'm now a master gun maker at the Royal Armies. It's 250 years since the Battle of Spore. That took place this battle near the end of the night, April 16, 1746. It was here that the army of George II invited both the rebel Jacobite forces and ending Stuart claims to have probably been Jack, uh, thanks very much for allowing us to come down and film you doing some of your work down here as master uh, gunmaker for the Armouries Museum in Leeds. What is it you're actually on with now, Jack? Well, at the moment we're uh, engaged in restoring an old uh, flintlock pistol. This is an Indian made reproduction of what they call an English lock. Right. English dog lock. Right. It's um, basically a very early flint lock of an early um, 17th century. And does the thing actually, I mean, it'll fire, will it? It, it fires is, yeah. yeah. Right. No, it's actually a shotgun. Oh, it's actually a weapon, yeah. Oh, so fire, yeah. it could actually cause somebody some serious damage then? It could do, yes. Brilliant. Yeah. And what about this one here? I noticed this one's got on here. Have you got the Engraved the Marathon Man. Yeah, um, these are reproduction blank firing uh, matchlock muskets. Right, okay. Um, they're made for the Honourable Artillery Company. And, and can I ask you, Jack, is it limited to, to just to firearms as far as the museum's concerned, or do you do any swords or anything else? We do occasional sword work, etc. Right. Um, 